All right, so today's question is a pretty quick one. The last couple I've done have been a little bit longer. Very simply, what is going to be the output of this console log statement? So we have an object. It's got a whole bunch of properties defined. So in the final line where we're doing the console log, what are the contents going to be of the object? So I'll let you think about that for a, min for a minute, and then we will uh, come back and take the solution. If you want a copy of this, it is down inside the description. There's a link to the code gist so you can grab your own copy of it. Okay, welcome back. So the solution for this one is going to be the fact that object will be an object, and inside of it, we're going to have a, which is tre, b, which will be fira, and c is going to be five, like that. And that's it. That's all we're going to have. And the reason for this is you need to understand that when you create properties inside of an object, it doesn't really matter whether you write them with single quotes or with double quotes or with no quotes at all. They will all be interpreted as strings. So remember that. In objects, every property that you work with is actually a string. It is saved as a string key for whatever the value is. So it doesn't matter that we've got them defined in different ways. It doesn't matter that A, B, and C are done without quotes and with quotes. It's just the fact that there is an A, there is a B, and there is a C. And if you define A, B, and C multiple times, you are going to be left with whatever the final value is for those. So these will replace the ones that come before. So these last three values, that's all that's going to be left. That's it. That's all we'll have inside of there. Uh, for those of you who care, that is Swedish. <laughs> um, just a little bit of trivia for you. Uh, so we've got the object. There's the solution. If we run it here, we will see that is what we get. And that's why inside of here, when you're writing it on the console, it doesn't write them differently. It doesn't matter how I define them here. This is just how it's going to write them out. It's consistent in how it does that. If you have any questions, please feel free to leave those in the comments. And as always, thanks for watching.